everybody, isn't it so annoying when you're analyzing the game in chess space and you accidentally make an illegal move and that whistle sounds and then you may be playing some more and it happens again? It can get really annoying. So there is a way that you can solve this problem. You have to go into the files and change it and don't worry because I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. So all you have to do is do exactly what I'm going to show you here. So you're going to go into the start menu, go into computer, go into your local disk up here, and now go into program files, go into chess space, go into sounds, go into board. Now you're going to see an illegal file here. I've already messed with this a little bit, but you're going to see an illegal dot wave file in there dot w a v now that file is the one that has the whistle sound you can click it to play it if you want to see and so when that makes the whistle sound on the board when you make an illegal move it's going from that file so what you need to do is you need to make another dot w a v file to replace that one and this is going to be a blank audio file so what you're going to have to do is if you don't have audacity yet you should download that program. It's a free program, and a lot of you may already have it because it's very well known, very popular. But you just go online, you download it. It's totally safe to download. It's very, very well known. It's one of the most popular uh, programs there is. So you download that to your computer, and then you'll be ready to follow the next step. And that next step is you want to open up Audacity. You want to make sure you run it as an, as an administrator or else it may not allow you to make the changes that you want. So now what we're going to do is we've got to uh, mute this sound here. So, uh, so what we're going to do is record something. Okay, and I'll just uh, shorten it even or uh, go like, I'll just go like that. Okay, and now I'm gonna click on uh, go here, mute the track. So now this is muted, there's no sound there at all. So this is the kind of blank thing we need. So now you're gonna go in the file, and if you were to just save it now, it wouldn't work because it needs to be a .wav file. So you're gonna go into export, uh, okay, it's, it's not going to work when it says all audio is muted. So what we're going to do is uh, just go in here, unmute all tracks, and go to output volume at very low. Uh, let's go over here. So it's basically negligible. You can't hear it. So let's go again here, export. And so now you're going to have to find that again. So again, you go to computer, local disk, program files, chest base, sounds, board. And now you just type in illegal. And you have the WAV file, so make sure it's WAV. And now you're going to click save. And OK. And you click OK here. And now let's go in here and test this out. So you make an illegal move. It makes no sound whatsoever because it's going off the new blank file we've just created. So that's how you do it. So it's a little bit technical, but when you know how to do it, just by following these instructions, it will work. And this is really great because it was getting really annoying for me because I like to play music maybe sometimes when I'm looking at games and then hearing this annoying whistle all the time and <laughs> got on my nerves. So that's how you do it. Let me know if watching this video helped you out or if you have any other questions. And uh, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to see some more tech videos. So see you later.